These competition clips show a similar stepping Mawashi Geri as demonstrated in the last basic combination. The following sequences are practiced to develop good balance and powerful hip movements. Note that the hip is thrust straight forward on my Gary and pivoted on Yoko Gary. A strong supporting leg is essential. This sequence uses my Gary Mawashi Gary with similar pushing and pivoting actions. A strong supporting leg is essential. Make sure that the stance is wide enough to use the hips correctly when executing Hurricane Gyakuzuki. This sequence uses Mawashi Gary Yoku Gary. Note the double hip twisting action. Always apply full body power to every movement in the combination. Ashi Barai, or foot sweep, is used either to throw one's opponent or to disturb his balance in order to deliver an attack. The instep is used to make contact with the opponent's leg, and the hips are used to add power. The kick must snap through the opponent's leg and return to a stable stance in order to deliver the attack. Here, Ashi Barai is used to deliver various attacks. And here, Ashi Barai is demonstrated in various competitions. The kick now demonstrated is a Shiro Mawashi Geri, or back roundhouse kick. Note that the hip twist is coordinated as the kick extends, and that the foot travels on a curve to the target. The sole of the foot is used to strike, and this is usual practice in competition or training as a safety factor. But the back of the heel may be used to deliver a more powerful kick. The kick may also be delivered using a spinning action, as shown. Make sure that the hips drive in the direction of the kick, rather than let the upper body lean away.
Ashiro Mawashi Geri is now demonstrated in drill form using various methods of delivery. Note that the hips are driven powerfully into each kick. A useful practice method is to use a training partner as a target. A high degree of skill must be exercised in order to control the kick at skin level. Here, Ashiro Mawashi Geri is shown at various European championships.